For our next story, we take you to Bangladesh. Bangladesh had made remarkable progress, all thanks to the government initiative of Digital Bangladesh. As a result of this, rural communities are now reaping its benefits. This story is about how rural women of Bangladesh are learning dairy practices, all thanks to technology. This is the Digital Village Service Center in the rural district of Lahiri Mohanpur in Bangladesh. Promoting innovation and connectivity, a cooperative-run digital program is aiming to transform the lives and livelihoods of smallholder dairy farmers and processors. Meet 32-year-old dairy farmer Sadhona Haldar, who often face challenges brought by high feed costs and a lack of market access. She could not earn enough to provide for her four children. There were cattle feed problems as we were unable to sell the milk. This being a wetland region, we had to face many such problems. Women dairy farmers in Bangladesh are struggling to grow their businesses as they lack access to markets, loans, digital technology and information. This is where the Food and Agriculture Organization of the United Nations, FAO, comes into the picture. They are helping enable equal access to digital technologies for farmers. In Lahiri Mohanpur village district, where milk and dairy production constitute the main source of income for 500 families, FAO supported the creation of a cooperative-run digital village service centre to help farmers access information, financial resources and markets for their produce. There were a lot of things I didn't know before. After the Digital Village Service Centre came here, I learned many things. The Digital Village Service Centre keeps account of loans and keeps track of how much milk the cattle produce. As part of the Digital Village Service Centre's training programmes, both young women and men farmers are taught how to use the main tools for writing, communicating and keeping track of their economic activities. Women are receiving financial assistance and support in using social networks to sell their products, thus reducing marketing and transportation costs and increasing family incomes. After the training centre was established here, our area has been developed. Coming here is an opportunity for me, which is why I am so proud of myself. So we're able to help female farmers very specifically access real-time information on uh, product pricing, so the cost of or price of dairy on any given day, uh, real-time information on uh, uh, weather challenges, so they have real-time uh, forecasting of, of challenging weather events that may impact their uh, production, uh, early warning systems, uh, access to uh, pest management, et cetera, et cetera. So there's a lot of services that come through the Digital Village Center that are now accessible to all the female farmers within these associations. In Bangladesh, FAO has established 65 digital village service centers in 16 districts in collaboration with producers' associations to provide assistance to farmers in remote areas with poor access to digital technologies and markets. The second largest economy in the region has grown exponentially over the past few years. From being one of the poorest nations at birth in 1971, Bangladesh reached lower middle income status in 2015. It is on track to graduate from the UN's Least Developed Countries or LDC list in 2026. Helping these farmers achieve better production through digital agriculture is just that one progressive step in its development story.